Morning, beautiful. What was that? Mom? Mom? Yes, sweetie? Are you hearing voices too? Oh, honey, that's just your soulmate. My soulmate? Yeah, you guys can talk to each other. Sweet. Hello? Hey. This is so weird. What's your name? I'm not going to tell you that. I barely know you. Can I at least know how old you are? Yeah, I'm 19. Cool, I'm 20. Damn, 20? So no sugar daddy? How tall are you? I'm 4'11". Wait, so you're a dwarf? That's rude. Can I tell you something? Well, you won't shut up anyway, so what is it? What if I told you I know exactly where you are? I would say that is extremely creepy. Well, come to the front door. Can I tell you something? Well, you won't shut up anyway, so what is it? What if I told you I know exactly where you I are? I would say that that is extremely creepy. Well, come to the front door. What? Yes? Are you Giselle? Yeah, that's me. This is for you. Flowers? Who sent these? Who do you think sent them? Thank you. Did you really just send me flowers? Yes. Am I not sweet? Well, I mean it would have been sweet, but I never told you where I live. Just say thank you. They stink, by the way. Hello? Why aren't you talking to me? I don't want to talk to you, because you're being very creepy. How am I being creepy? Well, for starters, how did you know where I live? Maybe I know you already. Wait, what? Simon says stop putting lipstick on. Simon says? What? Hey, Mom. What's up, hun? Who is Simon, and why is he telling me what to do? Oh, no, it started. What do you mean, what started? It's a game. You have to do whatever Simon says. If you don't, something terrible will happen. But be careful. It'll try to trick you. Yeah, I understand. Simon says go to school. I guess I gotta go to school now. Hey, Jessica. Hey, Giselle. So what happens when you don't do what Simon says? Simon says hold up two fingers. We're safe. I'll see you later. Hey, where's Jessica? She's not in class today. The game tricked her. She's gone. Put up your hand. Giselle, no, it's a trick. Come with us. Put up your hand. Giselle, no, it's a trick. Come with us. What do I do? I'll distract them. Run. Whoa, why are you running? I'm trying to get away. The Simon Says game tricked me. And now they're looking for me. I know a place you can hide. Follow me. Thank you. Okay, we're here. Thank you for bringing her to us. You set me up. How could you? It was for a reward. I really needed the money. You sold me out for money? That's enough. You're coming with us. We're almost there. I'm sorry, but where are you taking me? It's best not to ask any questions. Just keep quiet and follow us. Okay, we're here. Can you at least tell me where we are? We brought you to meet Simon. He requested to see you. I'm a gummy, gummy, gummy. Stop playing. Gummy! Playing is against the law. You're lucky no one saw you, or else you would have been killed. Catch! Let's play. We're not allowed. We'll get killed. That's only if they see us. No one's around. Okay. Catch. Catch. <laughs> Catch. Catch. Were you girls playing? No, I wasn't. It was just her throwing the ball. I wasn't playing. No, she was playing too. No, I wasn't. No, Poppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? No, Poppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? Were you playing? 
I wasn't playing. I was just teaching the puppy not to play. Good work, kid. I'll kill the dog. No! Brianna, we're all gonna hang out after school. Are you coming? A hangout? Are you crazy? Relax, we're all just gonna talk and study. There's gonna be no games or playing. Hey, we should all play spin the bottle. No, I thought we were just going to study. We're not allowed to play. What are you scared? Are you a chicken? No, I just don't want to die. All right, I'll go first. I can't believe you're actually doing this. Look at that, the bottle landed on you. That is not happening. Were you playing a game? No, I wasn't. It was Brianna's idea. Speech? What's this? It's a new thing started by the government. You're given a certain amount of words a day, and you must use all of them, or else. Well, I only have 18 words today. That shouldn't be hard to use. Brianna, how many words do you need to use today? 18. Wow, you're so lucky. I got 5,000 words I have to use today, so I have to talk super fast, and I have to use lots and lots of words. Talk, 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 talk. I can't stop talking, can't stop talking. The day's almost done. Did you use all your words? Yes. These are my last words, too. Oh, no, 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 no. Honey, what's wrong? I got 100,000 words to use today. How can I use all those words? You'll have to try your best. Understand. I only had 55 words, now I have so many. What's wrong with your voice? I lost my voice talking so much yesterday. I won't be able to use all my words. No, no, you can do it. You can. I can hardly talk. I want to switch my words back. Hello? The government? Are you there? God? Let's see. Keep on trying to talk. The day is not over yet. I... I can't. It's okay. It's not your fault. I heard from your best friend's mom she passed away. She couldn't use all her words. Are you okay? Yeah. I'll be okay. I got 69 crushes. There's no way that's true. And why not? How many crushes do you have? None, but I don't need any. Oh. Here, you drop this. Thank you. Whoa, I got one crush already? That was fast. How did my crushes go up that fast? I haven't even spoken to anyone. Hey, Brianna. Hi. Hey, Brianna. What's going on? I'm like all of a sudden popular. Whoa, there's no way I have over a thousand crushes now. I don't even know that many people. Um, Brianna, I think it's because of this. Oh. My. Um, Brianna, I think it's because of this. Oh. My. That is not how I remember it. Oh. Here. You drop this. Oh my gosh, it's hair flip, girl. Quick, do the hair flip. Uh, I'm so sorry. I'm running late to class. Look at Brianna sitting there. She's such a pick me. I know, she's just sitting there like, pick me, pick me. You guys know I can hear you, right? Hair flip, hair flip, hair okay, flip. Okay, I'll do it. Whoa, yo, I got that on video. Hey, bestie. It's so nice to finally be popular. Wait, why are my crushes going down so fast? You might want to see this. It's time for your fifth mark. Yay, I'm so excited. I'm finally going to be five. Congratulations! Yay, me! Time for your 10th mark? Finally! I'm so excited to grow up. And you're all done. It's time for your 17th mark. You're going to be an adult next year. There, you're officially 17. Now you only have one year to figure out what you're going to do for the rest of your life. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. It's almost time for our yearly mark. Have you applied to any schools yet? No, I haven't decided yet. Well, now's the time to figure it out. We're getting our marks tomorrow. We're going to be adults. All right, it's time for your 18th mark. I hope you're ready for adulthood. Actually, I have to use the washroom. I'll be right back. What would happen if I don't get my 18th mark? Would they even notice I'm gone? I'm not going back there.
Um, I'm home. What? How is that possible? I only have 17 marks. Look who just turned 18. Yeah, I guess I am. Let me see your new mark. No, you're not 18. You only have 17 marks. That's so weird. I got my 18th mark. I must not be 18 yet. Look at us. We're 18 now. Wait, where's your 18th mark? I... I got my mark. It just didn't show up. I guess I'm not meant to be 18 yet. Did you hear? Her 18th mark never showed up when she got it. She's still 17. That's not even possible. Brianna? Uh, yes? Please go to the office. There's someone here to see you. Ooh, she's in trouble. Do you even know what you've done? You've messed with time as we know it. No one in the history has missed getting their mark. There's major consequences for this. What's going to happen is... Hey, loser. What? I'm assuming that was for a task. What number are you on? I just got into the 90s. Haven't you heard? The last 10 tasks are impossible. I'm sure I'll be fine. Slap someone? Too easy. Hey girl, can I ask you a favor? Yeah, sure. What the heck? Sorry. No, you're good. Just remember you owe me one. Hey Giselle, have you heard about Brandon? No. His 95th task was to break someone's arm. And he did that for some money? Yeah, he did. But the thing that scares me is the whole school is going into the 90s now. Things are going to get crazy. Stab someone? There's no way I'm doing that. Hey, Giselle. Jess, hey. Remember I said you owe me one? Stab someone? <laughs> There's no way I'm doing that. Hey, Giselle. Jess, hey. Remember I said you owe me one? What is it? I need to flick your forehead for a task. <sighs> Thank gosh. I thought you would have to, like, break my arm or something. Relax. I'm not even in the 90s yet. I do have to tell you something important, though. What's up? I can't tell you here. We have to go somewhere private. Okay, maybe I can tell you here. Jessica, you're scaring me. Just tell me. A group of guys are working together on the tasks to split the cash. Oh my gosh, there they are. What do we do? Run, we have to hide. We have to protect ourselves. Here, take this. Scissors? You never know what's going to happen. You guys really thought you could hide from me? What do I do? Giselle, do anything, quickly. I just stabbed him. You two really thought you could hide from me? Jessica, what do I do? Giselle, do anything quickly. No, I just stabbed him. It's okay, let's just get out of here, it's not safe. Okay, Giselle, what's your next task? My next task is to kill someone. And it's already been checked off. Wait, did I kill him back there? I mean, you probably did. Come on, let's go. Okay, I think we can stay in this room for a bit. How are you so calm about this? There's something you don't know. I've tried to complete the hundred tasks before. You mean you've done this before? Yes, but I failed. So now I'm going to help you. What's your next task? To shoot someone. Okay, here, take this. How do you have a gun? Because I already knew this was going to be the next task. We have to leave. They found us. We're not going to be able to outrun them. You have to shoot them. Giselle, do it. We're not going to be able to outrun them. You have to shoot them. Giselle, what are you waiting for? Do it. I just shot someone. Okay, come on. We have to get out of here. No, I can't believe I just did that. Snap out of it and stay calm. What's your next task? Next task is to break someone's arm. Okay, come on. Let's go. What are you doing? Please don't hurt me. I can't. The longer you take, the more painful it's going to be. Just do it. Come on, Giselle. You have to finish this. I'm on the last task. This is almost over. I mean, it's not quite over yet. Check the last task. What are you doing? Put the gun down. You thought you were going to win? Jessica, how could you? I took it once, then I check it. <sighs> Why am I on a beach? I must have gone too hard last night if I don't even remember where I'm at. That guy over there is like not moving. I should probably check if he's okay. Hello, sir, are you okay? Dude, yo, 
Maybe he'll wake up if I slap him. <coughs> oh, that was a lot of water. Are you okay? You you just saved my life. Oh, no, I was just walking by. Was that a mermaid? Forget about that. I'm in love with you. You've saved me. <gasps> I was not supposed to find you. What? What are you talking about? Nothing. You have to come meet my father. I can show him I finally found a wife. I'm sorry, wife? I'm Prince Eric, and I would love for you to be my princess. <laughs> I can't get married to you. What? You have to marry me. That's how the story goes. Oh, there you are. Good morning, dork. I am not a dork. Whatever you say. Hey, do you think my new haircut looks dumb? I don't like it. I think it looks really good. Right, you have to say that because you're my best friend. That's not true. You look great. Did you hear that we're getting a new student too? Yeah, we haven't had a new student in so long. <laughs> I know, I wonder who it's gonna be. Class, everyone meet Macy. Whoa, she's so pretty. Yeah, I, I guess so. Hey Macy, you should come over here. Take a seat next to us. Hi guys. Oh, uh, my name's Jason and this is Bailey. Nice to meet you. You should come sit with us at lunch. Would that be okay? Yeah, for sure. Good morning. Uh, he didn't leave a seat open for me. Oh, my bad. I kind of forgot. I'll see you at lunch then. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Macy, what were you saying? Girl, you better tell him that you love him. I don't love him. Are you sure about that? Dropped this. Oh, thank you. I don't even own a TV. Whatever, I guess I'll just throw this away. What is this? I guess the only way to find out is to push one. Now I just have to figure out what that exactly caused. Why did all those people freeze at the exact same time? Does this pause time? Oh, I'm gonna get some good use out of this. Everyone, please put your phones away for the test. I forgot about the test. I know what to do. Just gonna steal the answer key real quick. Don't mind me, sorry. Play. You may now begin, you have one hour. Hey, uh, can I talk to you? What's up, babe? Yeah, so I'm sorry, but I have to break up with you. What? Mm, just one second. Hey, babe. Oh, uh, hey, what's up? I'm breaking up with you. What? Are you serious? Yeah, bye. Oh, wow, <sighs> are you trying something new with your hair? No, what do you mean? Look at yourself. <gasps> what happened to my hair? Honestly, I think it's kind of cool. It looks like a bird's nest. Looks like you have some pink strands of hair now, too. Apparently. I guess it could have been worse. It could have been country. I fell in love with an emo girl. All I want is... Very funny. You know, you kind of look like Machine Gun mm. Kelly, too. Thanks. Why do you look like Hot Topic threw up on you? Guys, okay, it wasn't me. It was my soulmate. I don't want to dress like this. You know, maybe you should. It kind of suits you. Maybe your soulmate just has a crush on Avril Lavigne. That's fair, me too. Or they might be like a super famous rock star. I really doubt that, but it would be super cool. Guys, is that who I think it is? Looks like your rock star isn't that far away after all. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Uh, uh nothing. You are a terrible liar. You know you can't go outside until you turn 21. But why? I'm 18, isn't that close enough? No, you're not going outside. I need to know what's out there. I'm going to work. Don't try anything while I'm gone. Okay, see you later. Why is there nothing good on Netflix right now? Who's there? That's definitely not my mom. Bailey, honey, listen to me. There's somebody inside the house. I saw it on the cameras. You have to leave now. But I can't go outside. It's just this one time. The police are on the way to save you right now. What do you mean they'll save me? Okay, this is it. I'm going out the window. <coughs> Ooh. Hey, you can't touch anything. Why not? You can only touch three things today. I don't understand what the big deal is. You have to save them in case of an emergency, okay? I'm sure it'll be fine. You can only touch your own body or things you're already wearing. I know. Everyone take out your textbooks and open to page three. I can't. You can't touch anything again today, Bailey? Just how it is, I'm sorry. You can follow along with what we're doing on the board. Hey, do you think you can hand me a pencil by any chance? No, uh, I'm sorry. Why not? I can see that you can touch three things. Just use one of them. No, I'm sorry, just ask someone else. I want you to do it. 
Hey, what are you doing? Let go of me. Look, it's not that hard. Bitch, did you just slap me? Yes. You're gonna regret doing that. Reason? Reason of what? Sorry, I forgot to tell you. You have to pick the reason you die. I don't wanna choose the reason that I die. You have to, we all do. Well, it's definitely not gonna be by drowning. I'm gonna pick the most painless one that I can. Good luck, I don't think any of the options are good. Murder? Oh my God, that's way worse, no. Can this give me an option that doesn't suck brutally? <laughs> Bailey! Oh, sis, what's wrong? I didn't pick a reason in time and it picked one for me. What? It picked one for you? Apparently you only get three choices. I didn't know that. I'm so scared to ever get into a car again. I'm so sorry. Be careful with your choices, okay? I will. Please just give me something painless. Mommy, what's this? You can either be dating or married at 20. Oh, well, I want to be married. That's very young. I know, but I want to be just like Cinderella and marry my Prince Charming. I'm definitely going to have to set up an arranged marriage for her. Mommy, this just came on my finger and it's not coming off. That's what happens when you pick the married option. You may not remove the bandage until you turn 20 years old. Talk to any cute princess tonight? No, ever since this appeared on me, no princess will talk to me. Dang. They're probably just afraid of marriage. Yeah, I guess. If they won't talk to you, that's their loss. Thanks. Wait, you have one of these too. Oh, yeah. How did I never notice that? I guess since I'm a guard, you just don't pay attention to me. <laughs> you can remove your band-aid. I know, I'm so nervous. I can't wait to see what prince I get. Happy birthday, you can take your band-aid off. I know, I'm so nervous. I can't wait to see what prince I get. Remember, it'll be their first initial. It's an S. But wait, I don't know any princes whose names start with the letter S. Good thing I made an arrangement. What kind of an arrangement? Marriage, of course. I found you a very handsome prince. Does his name start with the letter S? Well, no. Then he's not my soulmate. Happy birthday, Violet. What's wrong? My mom. She's forcing me to get married tomorrow. To someone who's not your soulmate? Yeah, Sam, maybe you can talk to her. She thinks really highly of you. I mean, I'm just a guard, but I'll see what I can do. Wait a minute. Sam? S? He could be my soulmate. Sorry, your mom didn't listen. Never mind that. Sam, when do you get to remove your bandage? Actually, my birthday is tomorrow. No, you need to remove it right now. Huh? Why right now? Because I think you and I might be soulmates. No way. I think you and I might be soulmates. No way. Please, just take off the bandage. Violet, I can't. It won't come off until I turn 20. All right, fine. But you better tell me first thing in the morning. I promise. I will. Your future husband has arrived. Actually, Mom, I really need to speak to Sam. Nonsense! You must not keep the prince waiting. Now, come on. Hello, princess. Is that an S on your finger? Yes, it's the first letter of my soulmate's name. Well, just so you know, when we're married, I will have that removed. It's literally ingrained on my finger. Then I guess you'll be losing that finger. <gasps> Mom, I am not marrying that prince. He is evil. What? Your guard, Sam, he's... He's what? He's dead, sweetheart. I'm so sorry. Sam can't be dead. I just talked to him the other day. I need to see him. The other guards found him unresponsive this morning. I'll take you to him, sweetheart. Sam, please, give me a moment alone with him. Of course, Violet. Sam, how could this happen? He had a V. He was my soulmate. You were so nice to me. I will never forget you. Oh, darling, you look so beautiful. You did choose to get married at 20, and now you get to finally marry your prince. I don't care. Do you take Prince Daniel to be your husband? I... Violet, wait! Please, stop the wedding. Sam? You're alive? Yes, you, you won't believe what happened. Sam, you're alive? Yes, you you won't believe what happened. Your mom, she poisoned me with a sleeping potion. What? But somehow, the spell was broken. True love's kiss. Mom, how could you? I... You said you wanted to marry a prince. Oh, so you two were plotting together. Well, we couldn't let you marry that scum, now could we? See, the thing is, Daniel, I'd rather marry a guard than a selfish, cowardly prince. I was wrong, darling. Please forgive me. Then let me marry Sam. 
And maybe we can talk about forgiveness. Yes, Violet, you have my blessing. Well, then what about me? You? You wanted to have my finger removed. Oh, yes, I did say that. <laughs> did he really say that, Violet? You know, as the princess's guard, it's my job to protect her from harm. Oh, please, you don't scare me. <gasps> really? Because you look a little scared to me, Daniel. I suggest you run now. Y yes, sir. I've been meaning to ask you this for a long time. Violet, will you marry me? Yes. I always had a feeling you and I were soulmates, Violet. Sorry you didn't get your Prince Charming. It's okay. I got something better. I can't believe you're failing math. What is this? You are an absolute foul daughter. An embarrassment to this bit. I've had enough of that. So class, when 1 plus 1 equals 4, you multiply by 6 and carry the A to the B. I need a nap to process this information. You know, it wouldn't hurt to have a look around. What's this? <gasps> this is all the answers! How did you do so well in math today? I guess you could say I am a math wizard. You are literally terrible at math. Hold that thought. Kevin's coming. Hey, why'd you pause it? How can you... I saw what you did in math today. What? How did you see me steal the answers? I was paused. And how are you talking to me right now? I'm paused. I don't know how or why, but I have the same ability as you. Also, I need those answers for math. What? No, I'm failing. I have a picture of you stealing the book. Give it to me or I'm going to report you. Fine. Where did Kevin go? He was just here. Kevin's stupid and I don't like him anymore. Kevin. Kevin! So, Kevin, I thought maybe if you wanted to be a nice guy, we could share the answers. Of course we can, for $50. Deal. Homework is all done. Code red, code red. There is an unknown stranger in the building. This is not a drill. Oh, my goodness. What are we going to do? Everyone, quickly, hide. Hey, why'd you pause it? Come on, Kevin. You and I are going to go find this jerk. No, I'm not going. Let's wait for the police. Yeah, and by the time the police gets here, who knows what damage he could do. You can't play hero. This is real life. Fine. Suit yourself. <clears throat> Coward. Hey, wait! Where is that jerk? I see someone over there. Come quick. That's the guy. I don't understand. He's still moving around. How is that possible? We're paused. We should go back. He must have the same ability as us. It's not safe here. No way. I'm going to- It's you two. You're the ones I've been looking for. Come with me. Police! Police, Ari! I'm not paused anymore! I don't hear any sirens. Calm down. I mean no harm. I've been sent here to protect you two. Protect us from what? There's people after you two. The ability you were given is very rare. Only a handful of people have it. They want to use you. What? Main character's best friend? I am definitely main character material. Hey, bestie! Looks like you're the main character, and I'm just your sidekick. No way. You're way more than that. These roles are ridiculous. The roles for the school play are out? Ensemble. Oh my goodness, I got the lead! Yeah, of course you did. Bestie, look over there, it's Brad, head of the school football team. He is so dreamy. Did you see his role? It's the main character's love interest. It is? Yeah, but don't worry, I don't even like him. Really? I'm gonna go talk to him. Hey, Brad. Who are you? Here, give my number to your friend over there. She's beautiful. Sure. How'd it go? Great, he gave me his number. Nice, I'm going to practice. Wait, can I do your makeup first? It makeup's almost done, just one final touch. I put something special in this just for you. It's burning really bad. Yeah, it's supposed to do that. I can't believe I just did that. I really let the jealousy get the better of me. What? Villain? I am not the villain. Hey, did you hear? Angela's in the hospital. They found poison in her system. That means she's still... Uh, I'm... Is, is she okay? Yeah, they said she's gonna make a full recovery. We should all go visit her in the hospital. No! I'll go alone. I'm her best friend. Angela, how are you doing? I brought you some chocolate. You. It's you. I know what you did. She's back and with more fashion trends from the 2000s that we have to bring back.
<laughs> Listen, hear me out for one second. The denim on denim is kind of hot. I love it. Especially in like this couple's aesthetic and with the necklace, I'm obsessed. I will now be buying a denim corset. Track suits, like why do we ever stop wearing these? They're so cute and you don't have to put any effort in because it already matches. I'm gonna buy this, but in hot pink. Just everything about Christina Aguilera, the gloves, the chain, the hats, I love the hat. Obviously I already did the braids too. I think they're so cute. Also just everything Avril Lavigne did. Like, are you kidding me? This is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I have these arm cuffs and I bought a tie because of this look. I'm obsessed with cargo pants and I'm very glad that they're coming back into style. Let me know what trends you missed from the 2000s because I have so many more. These are some trends from the 2000s that we need to bring back immediately. First of all, the black and white hair. It's just so good. I wish I could do it, but I'm afraid I'm gonna burn all my hair off. Somebody else needs to eat this up and tag me, please. You might wanna argue with me, but low rise jeans and hear me out. As someone who is not very tall, this makes my torso look so much longer because I have children sized legs. The crimped hair, blah, blah. why did we ever stop doing this? I kind of love the texture. It's fun, it's crazy, it's messy, but on purpose. Last but not least, okay. This, this whole aesthetic. The belt and the cargos and the bracelets, yes. I would literally wear this tomorrow if I had all of this. Comment a trend that you wanna see come back. I can't punch someone in the face, that is so mean. Wait, but for a thousand dollars, who's my victim? Hey sis. Uh, yeah, what's up? Remember that one time you stole my white blouse and got hot sauce all over it? Um, yeah, I remember that. I said sorry. It's time for my payback. Dude, you broke my nose. Yes, I'm rich. What's next? I want to buy myself a Chanel bag. You want me to cut someone's ponytail off? I'm sorry, but for 10K, I have to. Mom, I'm so sorry for what I'm about to do. What? What do you mean? Did you just cut all my hair off? Uh, yeah, looks like it. If I have to be bald, so do you. <gasps> I'm sorry. What? I can't do that, I'm gonna get arrested. I'll help you finish the challenge if you give me half the prize money. Hi beautiful, I'm gonna be doing my whole face of makeup using only filters. Starting with eyebrows using this filter. I feel like my eyebrows are close to this already. <laughs> We're done with brows, let's move on. You already knew what I was gonna do for contour. My head is definitely a rectangle. I'm built like a Fruit Loops box. This is almost exactly how I normally do it. I feel like it's gonna look really good. Time for some freckles, let's see what we get. I guess I won't be wearing this makeup outside my house. This is actually not that easy. I picked the random Halloween eyeliner for some spice. Of course it gave me the most difficult one. I have no idea if this looks good or not. I should have done eyeshadow first, but all right. One of my friends just asked me to hang out. Uh, not right now. Lastly, we are doing some random lips. Come on. Should I send a picture to my crush like this? Okay, and this is our final look from all of those filters combined. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't think I'm gonna go outside the house. I kind of killed it. I think I did a good job. Okay, what do you choose? Uh, I choose snow, cause I wanna be just like mommy. Aw, good choice, honey. Don't you worry, I'll teach you how to use your powers. Mom, please don't leave me. Take this, honey, so that a part of me will always be with you. Alicia, meet your new stepmom, Greta. What a pleasure it is to meet- Oh! My hand! I'm so sorry, I- I didn't mean to. My hand, it's blue! Go to your room. Is she going to be okay? She has frostbite, but it's mild. Are those the gloves I gave you? Good. Keep them on until you can get your powers under control. Darling, she could have killed me. I am so sorry. Her powers, they've been going haywire ever since her mother passed. Well, she is a danger to all of us. She should be locked in that room. No, I couldn't do that to her. Don't you care about me? Greta, of course I do. Then it's settled. She won't ever leave that room. Here's your breakfast, princess. Oh, thank you. <gasps> you took off your gloves? Uh, yeah, just for a second, though. Oh my gosh. Uh, stay back. I'm gonna leave the food right here. Wait. Hey, Alicia, can I come in? I don't know. Can you? Because it doesn't seem like anyone else is allowed in here. I'm sorry, but I can't have you hurting people with your powers. I won't. I can control them now. Okay, then. Make a single snowflake. Just one? Uh-huh. Like how your mother used to. See? It's all right. You can't do it. But I can learn. I know you will. But until then, you have to stay in here. Dad, please. Put your gloves back on, all right? I'll be back to check on you later. If no one's even allowed near me, what's the point of wearing these anyways? I have to get out of here. Here's your lunch, princess. Hey! 
Guards, stop her! She froze my feet to the floor. Put your gloves back on, princess. So you guys can keep me locked in here? I don't think so. <sighs> hey! Stop her! I made it. I'm... I'm free. But where will I go? Mom always said that I could create anything that I imagined, so why don't I just make a place for myself to live? Stop it. You got this. It's working. Whoa, I can't believe I made this place. I mean, it's not exactly perfect, but it'll do. I just feel like I'm gonna get a little bit lonely in here, so maybe I can make myself some sort of a pet. I've always wanted a dog. Oh, I think I'll call you Snowball. Well, well. Greta, what are you doing here? I'm here to bring you home. This is my home now. I think it's time I showed you my little secret. You have powers? Yes, I was a princess after all. Guess which one I chose? Why don't I just show you? You have fire powers? Mm-hmm. And I'm impressed with this place, but I think it could use a little remodeling. Stop! You're melting it! <laughs> exactly. Snowball, run! <laughs> Guards, get her. Yes, your majesty. Stay back. I'm... I'm warning you. Come on, work. That's enough. Let's go. <sighs> Sit down. Sorry for the restraints, Alicia, but your powers are just out of control. I want to speak to my dad. Oh, Alicia, I'm so sorry. Who wants to break her the news? What happened was all your fault, really. What are you talking about? Well, you see, dear, after you ran away, your father went to go looking for you. I begged him not to, but he wouldn't listen. He hasn't returned since. What? Yes, and I guess with him gone, I'm your guardian now. No, you have to send guards out to go looking for him. No one could survive in that snowstorm, Alicia. And to think this all happened because you ran away. The king is gone because of you. Take her to the dungeon. What if he's still out there, probably freezing to death? Oh, if I could just get my hands out of these things. Oh. It's no use. I'm never gonna get out of here. Focus. Focus. Who said that? You know who I am. Mom, please don't leave me. Take this, honey, so that a part of me will always be with you. The necklace, it, it must be magic. Mom, please, tell me how to get out of here. She's back, and with more fashion trends from the 2000s that we have to bring back. Listen, hear me out for one second. The denim on denim is kind of hot. I love it. Especially in like this couple's aesthetic and with the necklace, I'm obsessed. I will now be buying a denim corset. Track suits, like why do we ever stop wearing these? They're so cute and you don't have to put any effort in because it already matches. I'm gonna buy this, but in hot pink. Just everything about Christina Aguilera, the gloves, the chain, the hats, I love the hat. Obviously I already did the braids too. I think they're so cute. Also just everything Avril Lavigne did. Like, are you kidding me? This is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I have these arm cuffs and I bought a tie because of this look. I'm obsessed with cargo pants and I'm very glad that they're coming back into style. Let me know what trends you missed from the 2000s because I have so many more. These are some trends from the 2000s that we need to bring back immediately. First of all, the black and white hair. It's just so good. I wish I could do it, but I'm afraid I'm gonna burn all my hair off. Somebody else needs to eat this up and tag me, please. You might wanna argue with me, but low rise jeans and hear me out. As someone who is not very tall, this makes my torso look so much longer because I have children's sized legs. The crimped hair, mwah, mwah. why did we ever stop doing this? I kinda love the texture, it's fun, it's crazy, it's messy, but on purpose. Last but not least, okay. This, this whole aesthetic. The belt and the cargos and the bracelets, yes. I would literally wear this tomorrow if I had all of this. Comment a trend that you wanna see come back. I can't punch someone in the face, that is so mean. Wait, but for a thousand dollars, who's my victim? Hey sis. Uh, yeah, what's up? Remember that one time you stole my white blouse and got hot sauce all over it? Um, yeah, I remember that, I said sorry. It's time for my payback. Dude, you broke my nose. Yes, I'm rich. What's next? I wanna buy myself a Chanel bag. Do you want me to cut someone's ponytail off? I'm sorry, but for 10K, I have to. Mom, I'm so sorry for what I'm about to do. What? What do you mean? Did you just cut all my hair off? Uh, yeah, looks like it. If I have to be bald, so do you. <gasps> I'm sorry. What? I can't do that. I'm gonna get arrested. I'll help you finish the challenge if you give me half the prize money. 
Happy birthday. Hope you like your gift. Gummy bears, really guys? They're magic. Each one gives you a different ability. Okay, let's see what the red one does. Hey, check it out. Someone left five bucks on the street. Wait, don't go over there. That car came out of nowhere. How did you know that was going to happen? I, I don't know. I just did. Excuse me, Bria. Could I see you after class? You wanted to see me, Mr. Peters? Yes, I have an assignment for you. And it's not on paper, if you know what I mean. Actually, I have to go. Mom, I think we need to report my... What is he doing? Your little brother is building a tower. With bricks? No, wait, I think he's gonna... What color should I choose today? Hmm, just kidding. I already picked it. Let's go with blue. Hey, can I go to Jessica's party this weekend? No. Jessica is a bad influence on you. Mom, she's fine. Actually, she's fine. Okay, so can I go? No, I, I just said no. Oh, come on. Just let me go. Okay, sure, honey. You can go. I think I know what my ability is now. See ya. Hi, I'd like to return the shirt I bought here. Sure, do you have the receipt? I don't, I actually lost it. Oh, yeah, no receipt, no refund. Oh, but it still has the tags on it, and I have the card that I used to pay for it. Yeah, don't care, I need the receipt, okay? Your new return policy is no receipt, no problem. So let's get that refund started, shall we? Your brother wants to play. Would you just forget about me? I have work to do. Hey, Tommy, I just wanted to say I'm sorry, I shouldn't have yelled at you. Wait a minute! What? Who are you? <gasps> Yesterday's ability was really weird, so let's go with purple today. Please don't be bad. <laughs> hey, Dad, I'm gonna head to Jessica's party. Now, wait just a minute. Don't worry, Mom said I can go. I better let her have some fun before I break with the news about the divorce. <sighs> you and Mom are getting a divorce? I didn't... Oh, no, you got mine reading today, didn't you? Sweetheart, you weren't supposed to find out like that. Quite so. Good you morning, Bria. Good morning, Good morning, Mr. Peters. She's got such pretty eyes and a really cute butt. What a creep. Ew, there she is. I don't want to talk to her. Hi, bestie. Oh, don't bestie me. You are a fake friend. You know what? Take your friendship bracelet back. Ow! I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hit you in your face. Come here. <gasps> I can't believe she broke my freaking elbow. What are you looking at, Daryl? I don't care that you broke your elbow. Oh. Well, now that my elbow's finally healed, I'm going with green today. <laughs> well, what is that? Wait, can I control time? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Why are you packing a suitcase? I'm moving out, honey, remember? Yeah, the divorce. You know, this whole thing isn't right. I know you still care about Mom. You just need to show her a little more. Now, before I unpause him, I'm going to give him this to hold for Mom. Perfect. Daniel, who prepared this dinner? Dad did. I did? I, I mean, uh, yeah. Oh, baby, this is really romantic. Okay, I don't need to see this. You ready for the talent show? Wait, that was today? Don't tell me you forgot. Of course not. <laughs> <laughs> taught myself how to play this in one hour, so let's hope it goes well. She's really good. Your total's 20 even. Babe, I'm so sorry. I don't think I have enough. Hey, it's okay. I got it. Sorry if I embarrassed you back there. No, you're fine. I understand you're going through a tough time with your job. Tomorrow when the amount in my bank account appears, it might come as a bit of a shock to you. Listen, I don't care how low that number is. I'm going to love you just the same. Poor thing. It's time to see how little he has. What? My boyfriend is a billionaire? No, there has to be some sort of mistake. I, uh, take it you saw my account? Yeah, and you've got a lot to explain. Whose Ferrari is in our driveway? That's mine. Well, actually, it's going to be yours now. What? No, I am still mad at you. Come with me and I'll explain everything. There was a good reason for me lying. Oh yeah? Was there a good reason for you having me buy your meals for the past year? Heck, I even paid your rent one time. I know, I know. And I'll be paying you back for all of it. 
Why didn't you just tell me? Because every girl I've ever dated has used me for my money. I was tired of dating gold diggers, and I wanted to find a girl who liked me for me. I promise, I will make it all up to you, and I'm going to start by showing you where I really live. Whoa, now hold up. You have a Chick-fil-A in your kitchen? Yep, and there's a McDonald's upstairs. <laughs> Babe, who are you, Richie Rich? Excuse me for just a moment. This is crazy. One of my stocks just went up. A lot. Yeah, actually, I can see that. Why don't you look happy? I'm worried about your safety. You can't tell anyone that you're dating a billionaire. Why can't people know I'm dating a billionaire? Because I'm now one of the youngest billionaires alive. And is that a bad thing? I know a lot of people that would die to get their hands on my money. And you think they'll come after me? I know they will. Promise me you won't tell anyone about my money. Okay, I promise, but you do owe me quite a bit of cash, so what do you say? You take me on a little shopping spree? Well, I can't be seen buying you a bunch of stuff, but I can give you this. Babe, this is like 10K. You didn't owe me this much. I know. Consider it a thank you for being so kind to me. I want you to spoil yourself. Oh, hey, Lizzie. Where's your boyfriend? He's at his house. Why? Oh, nothing. I just think it's kind of sad how he never buys you anything. I mean, look at all the stuff you had to buy yourself. It must be hard to date someone poor. Actually, he's not poor. He's one of the richest people alive. What? Okay, question number one. Let's go. How old are you? That's so easy. I'm 20. What's four plus four? Eight? What kind of questions are these? What color is the sky? <laughs> Be so for real. It's blue. Hey Giselle, how have your questions been? Mine have all been super easy. I only have two questions left. I'm gonna meet my soulmate in no time. Lucky, mine are all hard. Good luck. What liquid is vital to live? Water? Okay, here we go, my last question. What is your brother's favorite color? But I don't have a brother. Mom? Mom? What liquid is vital to live? Water? Okay, here we go, my last question. What is your brother's favorite color? But I don't have a brother. What? Mom? Mom? Yes, sweetie? Do I have a brother? Why would you ask that? The system asked me what my brother's favorite color is. Come with me, hun. I need to tell you something. What is it you need to tell me? You do have a brother. I gave him up for adoption because I couldn't care for him. Do you know where he is? I have no idea. I'm sorry, honey. I need to go find him. Giselle, are you okay? You look like you've seen a ghost. My mother just told me I had a brother I never knew about and I need to find him. But I have no idea where to start. I think I can help you. What's my superpower today? Hello? This system is whack. Hey, girl. Oh, hey. What superpower did you get today? I don't know. It's still loading. That sucks. Yeah, tell me about it. I really like your dress, by the way. I wish I had one just like it. Oh my gosh, yeah, take it. Um, no, that's okay. Put your clothes back on. Okay, class, it's time for a pop quiz. <laughs> Sir, can't you just give us the A? You know what? Yeah, A is for everyone. Wait, for real? Yeah, why not? Cool. I can't believe you got him to give us A. Me neither, that's crazy. It's insane. Hey, I really like your glasses. Can I have them? Yeah, here, yeah, take them. Thanks. Oh, I'm definitely gonna have some fun with this power. What's my superpower today? Mind control? This is gonna be fun. Hey, big sis, can you give me a ride to school? No, you can walk. Let me rephrase. Give me a ride to school. Of course I'll take you. Cool, I'll wait in the car. Hey, Giselle, are you ready for the test? Test? What test? 
the math test oh my gosh i forgot about that 10 bucks says i can get him to cancel it you're so on okay class get seated and get ready for the test uh mr bates i don't want to write the test today too bad get seated cancel the test the test is cancelled no way you just did that hey jake hey giselle me and you are going on a date tonight no we aren't I said me and you are That's not gonna work on me. Do you think I'm dumb? What's my superpower today? It's stuck on loading again? This always freaking happens. Hey Giselle. Oh hey Olivia. Your hair looks so good. Why thank you. Are you lying to me? What? No. Well, that dress makes you look fat. Girl, doesn't Mr. Fitz look so good today? Uh, sure. Are you in love with him or something? What? No, that's ridiculous. That's a little sus. Hey, baby. You want to get drunk and nasty? For sure. Wait, you don't want to get drunk and nasty? Yes, of course I do. We're done. Daddy, what is that? That's your likeness score. From now on, every time someone likes you, your score will go up. And when you reach 100%, you get to meet your soulmate. Wow. Snow, meet my new wife. Hi. Oh, hello. Daddy, I thought you said when people like me, my score will go up, not down. I don't think she likes me. Of course I do. There just must be a glitch. Oh, the king's passing was so unexpected. Princess, I brought you a rose for your loss. Thank you. It's lovely. Where is my rose? It was a loss for me as well. He was my husband. I'm so sorry. I was just thinking of the princess, your majesty. Snow? Yes? I just noticed your percentage has been going up a lot lately. And father said that when I reach 100%, I'll be able to meet my soulmate. Hmm, no. That won't happen. Why? Because, dear, it's not meant to be for you. In fact, follow me. Let me show you something. Here, you need to see this. A book? It's a magic book. Now open it and see why you can't meet your soulmate. Read the words. Magic book in my hand. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? The queen is the most liked. Her score is 80%. You see, dear, as queen I have a reputation to uphold. It was very hard for me to get to 80%, and I can't have you surpass me. But why can't we both reach 100%? No, it's either me or no one. From now on, you will no longer be allowed to leave this castle. But I promised the village kids that I would bring them toys today. So your likeness score can go up? I don't think so. I'm not going to break my promise. Thank you. And one for you. Thank you, princess. Wow, that was very kind of you, princess. Are those your guards? There she is! Get her! You have left the castle without permission, princess. I'm sorry. The queen orders you back now. Oh, don't hold her like that! Wait! My queen, we have found her. You directly disobeyed me. I'm sorry, I- Silence! Look at your score! I didn't mean for that to happen. Your percentage is higher than mine. Shall I still take her into the woods, my queen? Yes, and make sure she doesn't return. No. I'll make it quick. No, please. Quiet. Don't make this harder than it needs to be. Think about my father. What would he want you to do? The king would be so disappointed in me. I can't kill you, princess. You must leave here and never come back. But- Run, now. Hey, Shu, get out of here. Quite all. Why are you out in these woods alone? It's a long story, but my blouse, it's stuck in the vine. Don't worry, my dear. I will set you free. Come with me. It's not safe here. Son! Dad, where were... you? I just found this girl. Dad, this is the princess. Are you okay? Yes, but the queen, she's trying to have me killed. Why? I can't believe this is all because she's jealous of you. You can stay here with us as long as you need, princess. Our cabin is safe. Thank you so much. Of course. Here's an extra pillow in case you need it tonight. Thank you. I don't think I caught your name. Right. How rude of me. My name is Zachary, princess. Well, I appreciate your help, Zachary. <laughs> Good morning, my dear. My son and I are off to go hunting. We'll be gone for a few hours. While we're gone, do not open that door to anyone. I promise, I won't. How did you get in here? Go. Be free. 
I guess the likeness score works on animals too. Now that I'm at 100%, I get to meet my soulmate. That must be him. Now that I reached 100%, that has to be my soulmate. <gasps> Who are you? Oh, hello, my dear. I hope I didn't scare you. Actually, I'm not supposed to have strangers- But wait, I'm here to give you your soulmate. In that case, come inside. I brought this for you. An apple? Yes, you must be hungry. I don't like apples. But dear, I sense you're very lonely ever since your parents passed away. How do you know that? Because I'm magic. Isn't that how you feel? Yes, I, I've i been so lonely. This is why I'm here, to help you, dear. One bite of this apple will make your soulmate appear. Do you promise? Cross my heart. You'll never be lonely again. Isn't it just delicious? <laughs> You're so gullible. <laughs> Princess, we're home. No. This is my fault, Dad. Son. It is. I should have never left her alone. You'll be a queen in heaven. Goodbye, Snow. Soulmate found. Zachary? Princess, you're... You're alive. True love's kiss. I, I can't believe it. I can't believe what the queen did. This has gone too far, my dear. You must take back your kingdom. You're right. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? Princess Snow is the most liked. That's impossible. She's dead. Think again. Stepmother, you're under arrest. Guards, take her away. Get off of me! I'll be taking this. No! That belongs to me! That crown belongs to Snow now. And I gotta say, it really suits her. 